Hi everybody. Today our topic is to determine whether the equation of a circle defines a function or not. And as well, what about the semicircle? Does it define a function too? Let's move to analyze that. First, we shall solve the equation of the circle for y. Our equation is based on radius 1 and it is x square plus y square equal to 1. So y square equal to 1 minus x square. Then we get y equal to plus minus square root of 1 minus x square. So what this equation says for values of x for which x less than 1 and greater than minus 1 two values of y results. For example if x equal to 0, then y equal to plus minus 1. So, two different output result from the same input. This means that the equation x square plus y square equal to 1 does not define a function. Even, even if we look at the circle in graph, we can see that it is not a graph of function. Why? Because the vertical line intersect the circle twice. We can see it here. Two points this vertical line intersects. But the circle does contain the graphs of two functions of x. The upper semicircle defined by the function fx equal to square root of 1 minus x square and the lower semicircle defined by the function gx equal to minus square root of 1 minus x square. Here one formula first one y equal to plus square root of 1 minus x square it gives a real y value for every x in the closed interval from minus 1 to 1. We can see it here. Minus 1 to 1. Outside this domain, 1 minus x square is negative and its square root is not a real number. So here we got the domain as minus 1 and plus 1. The value of 1 minus x square varies from 0 to 1 on the given domain. And the square roots of this value do the same. So the range of square root of 1 minus x square is 0 and plus 1. Here in the first graph, upper semicircle, vertical line intersect at one point. We can see that. So it is a graph of function. In the second graph, the lower semicircle intersect the vertical line at one point. So it is not a, so it is a graph of function also. Yes, it is a graph of function because it intersects in one points. That's all for today. And thanks for watching.